This is Jim Smith again, and today I'm at Bob Grossman's house. He and his mother, Pat, built this house starting in 2005. It took five years to build it, and uh, it's not net zero energy, but it's got a lot of really great sustainable features. As you can see, it has, um, I'm counting, 28 solar PV panels. They're about 200 watts each. And over on the right, above the garage, are uh, six solar thermal panels. And this house is heated enti entirely by solar uh, radiant floor heating with the water going through 12,000 linear feet of PEX tubing underneath the concrete floors. Not only a concrete floor in the basement, but upstairs as well. This house is not going anywhere. So uh, let's go inside and I'll show you the mechanical room in particular. But also another thing about this house that makes it sustainable is that it is made with straw bales. It's a straw bale house. And there's what uh, Bob Grossman, who the owner calls a truth window, which I'll show you where you actually see the straw bale. Let's go inside now. In the house now, on the north wall, here's that truth window that uh, shows you the straw bale inside the walls. Look how, look how thick the walls are. They're at the width of a <laughs> straw bale. Uh, the floors are all concrete, which is painted or stained. Look at this great room here. Love this home. And here's the, the kitchen, an amazing kitchen here overlooking another great room of sorts. Uh, look at all these windows here. And again, the concrete floor down there with PEX piping under it to, for radiant floor heating. And then up there, the, the master bedroom has got its own window overlooking this floor. So let's go downstairs now and look at the mechanical room. In the basement now, notice the, the bare concrete foundation walls here. Here's a guest suite uh, in the ground level. Nice master bath with a walk-in shower and a nice uh, walk-in closet with its own laundry. Great guest quarters and they open onto this, this uh, area that we saw from above. And there's a study in here, or no, I'm sorry, a library. This is the library. But all this is just to, by way of getting you to the mechanical room where the action is. So here's the mechanical room and look at, look at that uh, manifold there showing the PEX tubing that's going to the concrete floor above and to the concrete floor below. And that is a gas tankless water heater that augments the solar thermal when it's a cloudy day and or when extra heat is needed. And there's the inverter for the solar electric system. So I say this home is not net zero. His, uh, his level billing uh, from Excel Energy is actually over $100 a month because of the extra power that's needed. Over in here is a home theater. I just couldn't resist showing you this. I guess it's being a uh, being a uh, realtor and all. Look at this nice home theater with a fireplace and a big screen. The projector is above my head and of course a popcorn machine. So that's that pretty much covers the sustainable features of this home. Thanks for watching.